Do you often think deeply and feel things more strongly than others? If yes, you might be a highly sensitive person. This means you notice and think about things more deeply. You're good at understanding how others feel. You notice small things, and you think a lot about your own feelings. HSPs are really good at seeing things from other people's points of view and are very creative and caring. But feeling everything so strongly can sometimes be tough. Sleep is super important. Just like most people, if highly sensitive people don't get enough sleep, they feel really grumpy and fuzzy-headed. They need a lot of sleep to feel okay. Loud noises are the worst. HSPs don't like very noisy places like parties or busy bars. They prefer quiet and calm places because too much noise and too many people make them feel overwhelmed. Feeling too much can be tiring. HSPs feel everything very deeply, which is great because they're very understanding. But it also means they can get tired easily from dealing with too many feelings. Thinking a lot about what people say, highly sensitive people are really good at picking up on little things people do or say, which can make them great friends. But they sometimes think too much about these things, worrying about stuff that might not be a big deal. Violence is really upsetting. Highly sensitive people find it hard to watch or hear about violence. Even in movies or on the news, violence can make them feel very upset. Letting go is hard. Highly sensitive people often hold on to feelings from things that happened a long time ago, like arguments or breakups because their feelings are so strong. Change feels scary. Trying new things or changing routines can make HSPs feel nervous because they like things to be predictable and comfortable. Criticism hurts. Highly sensitive persons are very sensitive to criticism or conflict. Even if someone is trying to help by giving feedback, it can make a highly sensitive person feel really bad. Pressure is overwhelming. Highly sensitive people don't like being rushed or having to do lots of things at once. They prefer to take their time and do things one at a time. Saying no is tough. Because highly sensitive people are so caring, they often find it hard to say no, even when they should, because they don't want to let people down. Being really hard on themselves. Highly sensitive people often worry a lot about mistakes they've made and can be very hard on themselves, even for small things. Needing time alone. Highly sensitive people need a lot of quiet time by themselves to rest and recharge because being around people for too long can be too much. Feeling misunderstood. Sometimes, highly sensitive people feel like other people don't get them. Because they feel things so deeply, it can be hard for others to understand why they feel the way they do. Being highly sensitive has its challenges, but it also means highly sensitive people are very kind, creative, and understanding. It's like having a superpower that lets you see and feel the world in a special way. If you're a highly sensitive person or know someone who is, remember that it's okay to take care of. While being a highly sensitive person can indeed present some unique challenges, it's important to remember that it also comes with a set of remarkable strengths. Highly sensitive people are often highly creative individuals. They tend to see the world through a different lens, and this unique perspective can lead to groundbreaking ideas and innovative solutions. They can transform the mundane into the magical, and their sensitivity often fuels their creativity, allowing them to produce extraordinary works of art, music, literature, and more. Moreover, highly sensitive people possess a high degree of empathy. They can truly feel what others are going through, making them remarkably understanding and compassionate. This quality can make them exceptional friends, partners, and caregivers. Their ability to feel deeply allows them to connect with others on a profound level, making their relationships rich and meaningful. Highly sensitive person also have an uncanny ability to notice the small details that others might miss. They are highly observant, picking up on subtle cues in their environment and in their interactions with others. This can make them great problem solvers, as they can often see things from a different perspective and come up with solutions that others might overlook. In conclusion, being a highly sensitive person is not just about the challenges, it's also about the unique strengths and abilities that come with it. Their deep sensitivity allows them to experience the world in a way that is rich, vibrant, and full of depth. So if you're an HSP, 
Embrace your sensitivity as a strength, and if you know an HSP, appreciate them for the unique gifts they bring to the world. As we journey further into the world of highly sensitive people, let's delve into some strategies that can help HSPs navigate their daily lives with more ease. First and foremost, self-care is important. Since highly sensitive people are more susceptible to overstimulation and emotional exhaustion, it's important for them to take time to recharge. This could mean practicing mindfulness, spending time in nature, or simply indulging in a favorite hobby. It's important to remember that it's okay to take a break and prioritize your emotional well-being. Next, setting boundaries is an important skill for highly sensitive people. It's important to communicate your needs and limits to others, whether it's needing quiet time after a long day or choosing not to engage in emotionally draining situations. Remember, setting boundaries is not about being selfish, but about preserving your mental and emotional health. Lastly, seek support from loved ones. Open up about your experiences as an HSP and let them know how they can best support you. You'd be surprised at how understanding people can be when they're aware of your needs. And don't be afraid to seek professional help if you're feeling overwhelmed. Therapists and counselors can provide valuable tools and techniques to help you cope. Remember, being a highly sensitive person is not a flaw, but a unique attribute that allows you to experience life in a deeply profound way. Embrace your sensitivity, take care of yourself, set your boundaries, and lean on your support system. You are not alone in this journey. As we continue to explore the world of highly sensitive people, it's enlightening to note that many well-known figures from various walks of life identify as HSPs. Their sensitivity has not only shaped their experiences, but has also been a driving force behind their creativity and success. Let's take a look at some of them. Firstly, we have the brilliant singer-songwriter Alanis Morissette. The Grammy-winning artist has spoken openly about her sensitivity and how it has deeply influenced her music and lyrics. Her songs often convey a deep understanding of emotions, a characteristic trait of HSPs. Next, we have the esteemed actor, Nicole Kidman. Known for her powerful performances, Kidman has often spoken about how her sensitivity allows her to connect deeply with the characters she plays. It's this unique ability to empathize and understand complex emotions that has led her to deliver such compelling performances. Another example is the celebrated author J.K. Rowling. The creator of the Harry Potter series has often described herself as highly sensitive. Her deep understanding of human emotions and experiences has allowed her to create characters that resonate deeply with readers around the world. Finally, we have Steve Jobs, the co-founder of Apple Inc. His keen attention to detail, high standards, and drive for perfection are traits commonly associated with HSPs. His sensitivity to minor nuances has been credited as one of the factors behind Apple's innovative products. These are just a few examples of famous, highly sensitive people, but there are many more out there. It's a testament to the fact that being a highly sensitive person is not a hindrance, but a strength that can lead to great achievements when harnessed correctly. So, remember, your sensitivity is a gift, not a curse. As we draw our exploration of highly sensitive people to a close, it's important to remember that being a highly sensitive person is not a flaw, but rather a unique trait that imbues you with exceptional capabilities. Your heightened sensitivity allows you to perceive nuances that others may miss, to empathize deeply, and to experience life richly. You have the ability to connect with others on a profound level, to understand their emotions, their struggles, and their joys. This makes you not just a great friend, but also a valuable team member, leader, and creative force. As a highly sensitive person, you are part of a group of individuals who have made significant contributions to the world, in fields as diverse as music, literature, acting, and technology. As we've seen, many famous figures who have left indelible marks on our world were, like you, highly sensitive people. Their sensitivity was not a barrier but a catalyst for their creativity, their innovation, and their success. So embrace your sensitivity, see it as a strength, harness it, it's what makes you, you. Remember, the world needs what you have to offer, 
Your sensitivity is a gift that allows you to bring a unique perspective, deep understanding, and profound empathy to a world that greatly needs these qualities. You are not alone, you are understood, you are valued. And you, as a highly sensitive person, have the power to make a difference. Thank you for watching. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe.